Hello, Irina Bjorne and Bell Books invite you for the series of the summer programs. And today it's the first program. It's called Memory Program. How to increase your memory, how to be better with concentration, and how to avoid Alzheimer. Alzheimer is just a big plague for a lot of people who just uh, experience lost the memory, who experience that they can't remember, they can't remember to, to switch off TV. TV it's small things, but if it's electrical devices or gas devices, so it's more complicated. So today it's our first approach how to avoid this. And again, Bell Books, it's a solution, it's very easy. It's a, it's a book for easy living. Solution only five minutes. And now our bill books in Amazon. It's just summer sale. Just look at this and buy it. A lot of people already bought them and enjoy them. And I have several reviews that it's wonderful for them just to try several exercises and enjoy this program. With that, we just clap the hands as we did in another program. Massage our face up. Yes, neck. Three times shake, shake the hands. And again, clap the hands, face, here, neck, three times shake the hands, and third time. It's very good for activation of the brain. If you are tired and sit all day with a computer, or if you're just sitting in the, in the room, in the office, or just sitting in the chair and looking at the TV, so I would like to say that sometime eyes and your brain start to be also drained because of static electricity. Our body is like a dipole, a positive and negative dipole. And uh, it means that a lot of positive charge start to be accumulated around the brain, around uh, your, your head. And if you still in your shoes and it's uh, usually it's uh, isolated you from the, from the ground, so this uh, charge change your well-being. So what to do, throw out your shoes and go to the grass and just uh, extra, extra discharge, go to the, to the earth, just electricity low. And then what uh, you can do also, if you can't go to the ground and to the lawn and to the park and throw out your shoes uh, and uh, just stay in the earth, if you can't do this, at least you can come, go home and then you find the uh, water tubes which is connected, usually connected to the soil, and you just put the both hands in this tube and stay for, uh, maybe shake a little bit like this, for one, two minutes. And part of your positive charge go to the earth. It's very easy, but it's not a solution. Solution the best to go to the, to the ground. And uh, positive charge. And then if positive charge around your brain, what's, what happens? That your eyes is tired, low, low concentration. So you, you have stress, so negative thoughts. Sometimes it's uh, dry eyes, so dry nose, dry mouth, dry throat. Your voice starts to be cracky and you... Mm, your skin starts to be cracky also, very dry. So it's all of this, it's a signal that positive charge, it's too much positive charge. So you need to just change the surroundings. You need to go to the ground. You need to, uh, to make this massage. What we do, do this now together with you three times. And uh, remember water. If you are sitting with a computer, remember just after one and a half hour, half glass water, it's good to drink. Why? Because it's also taking this positive charge and uh, change the electricity of your uh, body for more optimal way. What kind of water? Of course, we talk about this. Water should be living water. There is two kinds of water, living water and dead water. What is the difference? If you just have the some plant at home and you put dead water to this plant, plant will die. And uh, example here, it's a salt water from the sea, sea water. If you just water the plants with the sea water, plants will die. So it's, it's uh, dead water. That is why this dead water is good for the people who has some uh, skin rash or skin inflammation or some allergy, skin allergy. 
Why? It's because of a lot of fungus it's in your skin. When you go to the salt water, salt water of course kill this fungus so your skin will be more, mm, more clean without fungus so your environment will be better. Some people, yogi people, uh, tell that it's very good to drink also a little bit water in the morning with a little bit salt inside this. Why? Because the same effect. So you have some fungus which is uh, living in your stomach, living in your lungs also. So when you just drink this water, so in the, in the your channel here to the stomach channel, so all of the fungus will be killed on the way very very good also with the with your mouse and mouse it's a lot of fungus especially close to your teeth so if you have parodont or something like this it's just fungus so remember yogi folk they use the salt to brush the teeth sometimes it's uh, unpleasant but it's very 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 effective very effective against the uh, parodontosis living water so you living water, it's a water from the bottles. I prefer the water from the mountain, it's the best. From the wells, it's also good. But again, more living water, it's just uh, rustling down from the mountain. So it takes a lot of bubbles also, a lot of good air, mixing with the air. Good, very good combination. If you have the dog, you can just make the experiment, put the ordinary water from the tap and uh, water from the uh, really good very expensive water sometimes i buy the water from switzerland or from france from mountain so put a little bit of water and just watch your dog dog knows <laughs> what is the best water and always will prefer the water uh, expensive water from the bottles not from the tap so it's easy it's about the brain brain very small it's about 1.4 1.3 1.5 kilo of the the whole weight but if you look in the blood which is going to the brain it's about 20 percent of all blood going to the brain because it's very important fresh blood come and it creates some environment which is brain is activate when the brain uh, it's not activated it means it's passive it's not stimulated so people start to uh, forget something and then develop Alzheimer. I suggest for the uh, people who, who is uh, not so young start to, for example, to make the crosswords or some uh, uh, Sudoku is good also. My grandfather was playing chess up till he was 85 and uh, he was reading a lot of books. So it helps him uh, to be active uh, up till his last day. He was with a good memory, very, very good uh, person to communicate and uh, no Alzheimer at all. So it's very important stimulation. But it's very important that blood is coming to your brain. That is why um, what we are doing, we are doing also massage every day the neck. Neck massage very important, but it's important the position of your head. If when you communicate with the people, a lot of people do like this, so they close the neck in such way that blood can't go, can't go to the, your brain. So another, another mistake, so if you're afraid people, so you just uh, press, press your chin down and also you block your neck. What is the right position? Uh, my teacher told me that it's very easy to understand the right position. You put your index finger here and you just in in your chin and you just press the chin a little bit down a little bit down and this is position yes no this position it's optimal now it's uh, a lot of blood come to your brain now it's not a problem okay we make the break for five minutes and you uh, remember to, to uh, take a little bit water and we come back and then I show you five exercises which is very easy and which which is increase your ability for the remember something your memory will be better communication will be better we meet again hi